Right, Bill Cosby is the latest celebrity to be accused of abusing his position of trust. Yeah. Uh, as of now, nothing has actually been proven, mm. but there have been a few people who have come out and said some things about Mr. Cosby. Yeah, he's done things. Yeah. Now, obviously, he's he's not the first big name celebrity, and and you know, children's entertainer. Yeah. To, to, yeah. You, you would like for it not to be true. Well, of course, you know? of course. You know, I mean, I, I did grow up. I mean, I'm, I'm just on that cusp of. The Cosby Show. I am um, trying not to be too quick to rush to judgment. Going back to the Operation U Tree stuff in the UK, you know, with Jimmy Savile, with yeah. uh, David Lee Travers. Yeah. It's destroying kind of these cultural icons, uh, if you like, these role models that, especially around children's TV and children's entertainment. My attitude, dude, is if if they are guilty, then they, they can't be seen as role models to destroy. Of course not. Um, There's such a stark contrast yeah. by how you see them now because of what these pe women have come forward and said. Savile, I wasn't, I'm not going to be honest, I wasn't that surprised about. Savile was always a bit creepy and yeah, always a bit yeah. slimy, let's be quite frank. I mean, let's keep it 100. Allegations against Cosby aren't anything new. Apparently women have been saying this sort of thing for quite some time mm -hmm. and it's always been hushed up or suppressed or whatever. That's what's coming out now. The women who have said these things, usually they're, usually they're nobodies. They're, they're people who no one would really believe and you might even argue they are saying what they're saying possibly to get notoriety or to get a check or whatever it happens to be. I believe Janice, Janice Dickinson has said, has made claims, allegations against him. These women who are pillars in their own respective fields, they are res highly respected, they make their own money. It's sort of yeah. like, why would they make it up? That's what I have to sort uh -huh. of ask. And I also think to myself, saying these things would put themselves in the firing line, obviously because of who, who they're accusing. Yeah. Yeah. And not just that, but also to do with the fact that they don't need, they don't need mm -hmm. that grief. The actress who played... His wife in the Cosby Show. Well, she said that the allegations against him are, are made up and promoted by people who want, for some reason, to um, silence Bill Cosby. You there know, might well the, be an agenda here. You're dead, right? Was, I mean, you know, you've got to remember. Yeah. I think he was about to get his sink his teeth into a new show, directing it, it yeah. or writing it or something. Yeah, so, yeah, he's been doing the live shows, but he's had to cancel. You have to question at the same time, you know, why these why these women why these women would say these things. The timing of it, as as he's about to start initiating deals, getting some paper, maybe because obviously, when you get to his level there you're going to have enemies regardless of, of, of what you do yeah. even if it turns out not to be true or unprovable then it's still there is it? it has been made public that these people wanted to make a complaint against him for this and it's, it's already a question mark now. No, already yes. having yeah. an effect on yeah. his career yeah. and mm. this it's complete rubbish Will he be able to continue through? But he's, a, he's a man who's obviously very business savvy and very much onto uh, controlling his image. But these are the things that sort of cry out to me the fact that this, these, this is not something new. Yes, it's come at a bad time for him business-wise, but people have been accusing Bill Cosby of, of this type of thing. When you go back 15, 15 years, you know, a when, long when it, time ago, yeah. and he's an old man now. You know, where there's smoke, there's usually fire. And I have to ask why these women would say these things if these established women would say these things when, when, if there's nothing to it. And one of the other things that stuck in my mind is his sort of absolute refusal to acknowledge these claims. It's sort of like people are asking him for comment. He doesn't, he's, there is no comment he can make. He's not interested in making a comment. He's barely even acknowledging that, that this is going on. And that is, that's really, that, that's what has sort of made me really raise an eyebrow because that is w the weirdest, most unusual type of reaction in my mind. I would ask Bill Cosby, how can you not answer something like that? He's probably judged guilty in the, in the court of public opinion now anyway, but yeah, a woman yeah. comes out publicly and says, this man did something to me. How on earth can you ignore it? We don't, we don't make a comment about that. What do you mean you don't make a comment? She's saying, she's not saying that you took her muffin, she's saying you raped her, dude. And there are other women coming forward saying the same thing. If, if it's not true, most men would be like, 
Nah, she ain't saying that and getting away with it. It's completely untrue. He's just not making a comment. You probably go back through a lot of celebrities' history and see that people have alleged they did this, alleged they did that. And it is, like you say, usually unknowns mm. who are looking for a handout. Mm. But when you have someone... Established, like Janice Dickinson, other I mean, models just... back in the 80s and then early and the 90s when they're alleging this stuff has happened, mm. they were young and upcoming when, models. When, when Bill Cosby was at, at his, his peak. I find, I find it very disturbing how it's all coming to light these days. These men that we think we know, mm. these men who we thought we knew, seemingly and allegedly are abusing their positions, abusing their authority, their influence, their freedom, their stardom, their celebrity, to do things... To, to women and children. I find that, to yeah. say repugnant, is, 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 yeah, is the tip a, of the it's iceberg. Complete, it's not good for, obviously, the people who who these allegations come against, whether they be true or false. It's not good, then, for whoever their employers are. So if you, if you think the Jimmy Savile stuff, the BBC can now not show any of the old Top of the Pops that he... Presented, they can't show any of the you know Jim will fix, fix it. it. Yeah, but you see, yeah, but you see, they can't they can't show these things of because course. But when it's, it's been revealed in the last few years, mm. the extent of Savile's abuse and how and what and his reach, how many people yeah. he abused because of the extent of it. There's no, there's not one intelligent person who can who will honestly believe that. The BBC knew nothing. All the people back then who, oh my gosh, we heard rumours, we heard rumours. People knew about it. The BBC can't show any of his shows because they can't f claim ignorance. They couldn't have been ignorant. I, you, you could, you, no. Whoever was in charge at the time, whoever was, was around at the time, they must have known. And it's not even to say that Savile hit it. Yeah. He, would, he would talk about it. Some people would believe him, some people wouldn't. And, and it's just terrible. And then you get over that, and then, and then Rolf Harris... Yeah. I was gutted. Demanded animal hospital, for God's sake. I was having a conversation with this uh, older friend of mine. She said, it, you got to understand, it was normal back then. You know, She said she worked in a place where the, the boss fancied her and she wasn't interested. But he would, and it was, it was in this photo booth or something where they were, it was an enclosed space. So at every point, he would do his best to make sure he rubbed up against her, basically, whilst passing her and stuff like this. This stuff was normal. Mm -hmm. So it's a really fantastic thing that even decades later, you people are being brought to justice for things they did historically in the past, particularly if it... Because it was normal back then, even though it was wrong. Now, no, you've got to ask for that. that was, that's out of order, and that's great. It's great that people can have justice after, so long after the fact. I, it makes me wonder who's going to be next now. So we'll, we'll, we'll see how it plays out. We'll, I hope it's not true.